Hi and welcome back. As the world ended, so did television as we know it. But in the rubble, another type of television arose post-apocalyptic television. These shows feature a scenario in which society has collapsed. Evacuation we are not waiting around the fire. Here are some of the best post-apocalyptic TV shows you could watch this year. Number 10. Black Summer. Six weeks after the beginning of the zombie apocalypse, a mother is separated from her child and goes on a harrowing journey, stopping at nothing to find her. Accompanied by a small group of American immigrants, she must face a hostile new world and make difficult decisions during the deadliest summer of the zombie plague. Black Summer has a 6.5 rating in IMDb and a 61% in audience score in Rotten Tomatoes. Is there anywhere that's safe? Number 9. The Last Ship The first act begins with a terrible global tragedy that decimates the human population to unbelievable heights. Thanks to its anomalous position in the time of need, the American battleship Nathan James manages to escape by somehow avoiding the disaster and its crew will be forced to face the unavoidable reality that they are the sole survivors left in the world. The last ship has a 7.4 rating in IMDb and a 67% in audience score in Rotten Tomatoes. Seven months ago, outside Cairo, there was an outbreak. A virus that was like nothing any of us had ever seen. When we left Norfolk, the virus was at... Number 8. Falling Skies In the aftermath of an alien attack that has crippled most of the planet, shock has switched to resolve as the survivors gather to fight. Leading the charge is Boston history professor Tom Mason, whose wife was killed in the assault and one of his three sons is one of the captive teens. Desperate to save his son, Tom joins forces with the 2nd Massachusetts, a makeshift regiment created to protect the survivors. As second-in-command to Weaver, Tom uses his military history to obtain information about the aliens and devise an attack plan. But the plan keeps changing and more questions surface as the survivors find out what they're up against an extraordinarily intelligent, heavily armed alien force that has the most mysterious purpose on the planet. Falling Skies has a 7.1 rating in IMDb and a 69% in audience score in Rotten Tomatoes. They blow up army bases. All of the capitals. Then they came. Number 7. The 100. Over 12,000 people live in 12 space stations after a devastating nuclear war nearly annihilated all life on Earth. The station's residents banded together to form an orbiting mansion, collectively named the Ark. There are approximately 2,400 residents. There is no patience for failure to comply with law or danger to life floating. On board the Ark, the criminal study experiment of a prison, if all prison inmates are declared expendable, a hundred young children are sent to the surface to ascertain whether or not Earth is habitable. The teens visit a beautiful world previously covered by space. Before venturing into the dangerous new world, they must establish a society. However, they discover that not all humanity was destroyed. There are individuals still living after the Great War, considering that they've been called grounders by the 100. The 100 has a 7.6 rating in IMDb and a 66% in audience score in Rotten Tomatoes. It's been 97 years since a nuclear apocalypse killed everyone. Number 5. The Bite. The Bite chronicles the unexpected yet deadly second wave of the coronavirus outbreak in New York City. It follows the lives of two neighbors, Rachel and Lily, as they navigate through life in quarantine in New York City. While Rachel juggles her thriving telemedicine practice along with an unstable, passionless marriage, Lily is upstairs trying to convince her Wall Street clientele that her company's unique skill remains just as valuable over video chat as it was in person. When the unexpected second wave of the virus threatens, these two women must consider their careers, their families, and possibly the end of the world. The Bite has a 6.5 rating in IMDb and a 90% in audience score in Rotten Tomatoes. Your windows, now! I don't care if we're in the end times. Everybody has to pay their rent. Number 4. The Passage 
the world undergoes the effects of a perilous as well as contagious disease that turns people into bloodthirsty vampire creatures with hardly any options to survive. At this moment, there are only two alternatives to hide, escape or confront the vampires to eradicate them. The story revolves around a 10-year-old girl named Amy Belafonte, who is humanity's last hope. With her, the government attempts to do the necessary studies to find a solution for her, while the federal agent Brad Wolgas becomes her future foster father. The Passage has a 7.2 rating in AMDB and a 85% in audience score in Rotten Tomatoes. I'm not gonna leave you. It's gonna be okay. We're talking panic and chaos. Your life is important. Number three, The Last Man on Earth. In 2022, a catastrophic natural disaster devastates Earth, accepting retired and retired Phil Miller, plus his wife and daughter. Feeling alone, Phil travels the United States, Canada, and Mexico in his RV, searching for survivors. Maintaining the belief that there might be somebody else alive worse off than himself, Phil strives to make the best out of the remaining determination that he might not survive out there until the last survivor is met and all the turmoil ends. When the hardships associated with living there with other survivors start to become more acute, Phil struggles to live alongside others again. The Last Man on Earth has a 7.3 rating in IMDb and 81% in audience score in Rotten Tomatoes. Number 2. C. In a dystopian future where humans have lost their greatest sensory sight, humans now adapt to a new world through a combination of different interactions and social structures According to legends, it was God who took away humans' vision so that the Earth could be kept. However, everything they know is put to the test with the birth of the twin brothers who believe the myth with which they are acquainted amounts to nothing after the vision of the twins. The family of the newborns encounters a brand new danger, the evil queen who believes the newborn children are a threat to the Earth. C has a 7.6 rating in IMDb and a 88% in audience score in Rotten Tomatoes. astonishing how the smallest moment can change an entire world. Number 1. The Walking Dead. Sheriff Deputy Rick Grimes is shot and becomes comatose. When recovered, he's in a zombie apocalypse and has no idea what to do. Having to find his family, he does so and eventually winds up being connected with a group that becomes its leader. He takes charge of this group and tries to help this group survive, find a place to live and feed them. This show focuses on survival of individuals, the risks, and the need for how you to survive. The Walking Dead has a 8.1 rating in AMDB and a 78% in audience score in Rotten Tomatoes. He's a man looking for his wife and son. Would you like to see more of this video? Take a look at others of ours and subscribe to be notified when we make new ones. See you next time. Goodbye.